Well, I hope you had a great weekend, everybody. Uh, weather cooperated for the most part across most all the Badgerland. However, things are changing in a big way. Your weather headlines on this Monday looks like we're going to be wet in some form or another till Wednesday. We start with kind of light drizzly drops and then eventually we'll see some heavy shower activity rolling into northeastern Wisconsin as we head toward the nighttime hours tonight and tomorrow. It'll at least be a seasonal stretch, so not one of those really cold rains, mild temperatures, and then get ready for a fine finish to this work week. Outside right now across northeastern Wisconsin, temperatures not bad at all with the clouds blanketing us, acting as that blanket like we have on our beds. 50 degrees outside, the winds off the lake at a gentle 5 miles an hour. And across northeastern Wisconsin, everybody pretty similar, near 50 degrees, 48 degrees for you fine folks waking up with us in Clintonville. It's 49 in Ocato, 52 in Menominee, and along the Door Peninsula from Sturgeon Bay into Sister Bay, near 50 degrees as well. That continues right down the lake from Kiwani into Manitowoc and even down into Sheboygan. Temperatures across the north central part of the U.S., well, they continue to be mild as well. This is a good indicator of a nice surge in moisture that's coming our way. 56 right now in KC. 54 in Des Moines, just down to the south in Chicago, 57 degrees, and even up to the north in the UP, not bad, 45 degrees in Marquette. Satellite and radar combination shows, well, we start getting enveloped across the entire badge of land with clouds as we go through the nighttime hours. We've had a few sprinkles, real light stuff out there for the most part, but there's more noticeable shower activity off to our west and also down to our south. The stuff to our south is what I'm really particularly concerned with because check out our precision cast computer model. And you can see this big surge of moisture coming at us as we approach the evening hours. I think as we go through the nighttime hours tonight, we'll have some substantial downpours and we could be picking up a pretty decent amount of rain in the rain gauges as we head toward the next couple of days. In fact, as we go into tomorrow afternoon, another swath of precipitation coming in our direction. So your precision forecast for today, this Monday, well, it looks kind of cloudy, patchy fog and drizzle through most of the day. Otherwise, showers developing late. Our temperatures topping off near 64. Tonight, we'll drop to a reasonable 49 degrees with showers and some heavy downpours at times, kind of breezy. Those winds out of the northeast, 10 to 15, gusty. And then tomorrow, oh, it'll be even windier with clouds and seasonal temperatures up to near 55 degrees. But more rain and even a few cracks of thunder, those winds could gust to near 30 miles an hour. Here comes your precision 10 day outlook and it does look kind of wet right through Wednesday. A few drizzle drops or sprinkles of possibility on Thursday, though I think most of Thursday into Friday dry and even most of the weekend looks dry as well. Our temperature seesaw back and forth between the mid 50s and near 60 degrees. So no huge downturn in temperatures. That's something to look forward to.